Next on BGSU Brain Game, it is Allen East versus Olin Tangi Berlin. I think we better get ready for some crazy cranial combat. Only one team can leave victorious. Who's it going to be? Only one way to find out. BGSU's Brain Game starts right now. Welcome to BGSU Brain Game. It is Allen East versus Olin Tangi Berlin. Let's take a look at the starting lineup for Allen East, led by Coach Dixon. In slot number one, we have Sophia, a junior. We have Ransom, a senior. And in slot number three is Cole, a sophomore. Let's take a look at your starting lineup for Olin Tangi Berlin, led by Coach Berg. In slot number one, we have Martin, a junior. In slot number two, Anna, a junior. And in slot number three is Rahid, also a junior. And that is your starting lineup for this episode of BGSU Brain Game. We're going to start things off as we always do in our toss-up round. Our toss-up round goes a little something like this. There are 10 questions in this round. They're worth 10 points apiece. No deduction for an incorrect answer. You may confer before buzzing in, not after, and you can steal a question in this round. Alan East, Owen Tangi, Berlin. Toss-up round starts right now. First question, multiple choice. Home to both Lake Champlain and the Green Mountains, this, this present-day New England state was home to Ethan Allen and his Green Mountain Boys. Was it A, Rhode Island, B, Maine, or C, Vermont? That would be Allen East, Ransom. C, Vermont. That is correct, Vermont. Which art form is usually begun with a ball of material placed on a rotating surface while the artist creates a shape using his or her, that would be Alan East, Ransom. Crochet. Incorrect. Once created, the objects is usually fired within a kiln. Olin Tangi Berlin, would you like to steal? That would be Rahid. Is it pottery? It is indeed pottery, ceramics, or earthenware. Another multiple choice question. Who commanded the Union Army at the Battle of Gettysburg? Was it A, George Meade? B, Ulysses S. Grant, or that would be Olin Tangi Berlin. Martin. Ulysses S. Grant. Incorrect, or was it C, George McClellan? Alan East, you have a chance to steal. That would be Ransom. A. That is correct, A, George Meade. What day is commonly known as Star Wars Day? That would be Alan East, Sophia. May the 4th. That is correct, and may the 4th be with you as well. Adjective that describes numbers found in computer science that only use the digits zero and one. That would be Alan East Cole. Binary. Binary is correct. For any simple machine, the ratio of the output force to the input force is equal to which measurable quantity used in the assessment of the performance of a machine? Time. That would be the mechanical advantage is what we needed there. Devon's career goal is to become a person who designs buildings and works closely with, that would be Alan East Cole. Architect. Architect, yes. Which career is he pursuing? He's pursuing the career of an architect. Known for their low profile and highly fluid lava, volcanoes of this type include Mauna Loa and Kilauea. Of the three types of volcanoes, volcanoes, excuse me, which one has the lowest concentration of silica in its magma? That would be Alan East, coal. Dormant. Incorrect. Olin Tangi Berlin, would you like to steal? Time, shield volcanoes is what we needed there, shield volcanoes. In insurance, what name is given to the dollar amount consumers must pay out of their own pockets prior to their insurance providing coverage during a loss? That would be Olin Tangi, Berlin, Anna. Out-of-pocket costs? Uh, will we accept out-of-pocket cost? 
We will accept that, yes. Which element is located in the periodic table of the elements directly below oxygen and is combined with rubber in the vulcanization process? That would be Owen Tangi Berlin. Anna. Silicon. Incorrect. Alan East, would you like to steal? That would be ransom. Uh, fluoride. Incorrect. Sulfur is what we were looking for there, sulfur. That is all 10 questions in the toss-up round. Let's take a look at our score. Currently, we have Owen Tangi Berlin with 20 points, and currently in the lead with 50 points is Alan East. But you're going to want to stick around because our risk and reward round is coming up next. And welcome back to BGSU Brain Game. Olin Tangi Berlin, 10 points. Allen East, 50 points. Before we move to our next round, looks like we have some substitutions. Let's meet our new players. Starting with Olin Tangi Berlin in slot number one, we have Annabella, how you doing? We have in slot number two, Ryan. In slot number three, we have Ethan. Alan East made only one substitution, and that's in slot number four, that is Justin. So welcome to our new and our returning players. This is our risk and reward round. It goes a little something like this. There are 10 potential questions in this round. The first nine questions are 10 points apiece, no deduction for an incorrect answer. The 10th question is our risk and reward question. You can risk up to 30 points in five point increments on a topic that we give you. Get that question right, you get the bonus points. You get it wrong, you lose those points. That's why they call it risk and reward. Olin Tangi Berlin, since you have 10, you're gonna be going to isolation. Alan East, you're gonna be sticking around, so off you go to isolation. Olin Tangi Berlin. All right, Alan East, are you ready for your risk and reward round? Mm -hmm. Starts yeah. right now. In 1848, the Free Soil Party was founded in this New York City that sits on the shores of Lake Erie. Named this city known for its proximity to Niagara Falls, massive quantities of lake effect snow, and an NFL team known as the Bills. That would be Ransom. Buffalo. Buffalo is correct. True or false, Australia, excuse me, Australia is surrounded by three oceans. That would be Sophia. True. True is correct. The Pacific, the Southern and Indian Ocean. The most common elements are hydrogen, carbon, and what? That would be Justin. Nitrogen. Incorrect, oxygen. What part of one's body does the disease alopecia affect? That would be Justin. The hair. The hair is correct. This animated film is based on The Snow Queen by Hans Christian Andersen and features the hit song, Let It Go. That would be Ransom. Frozen. Frozen is correct. Which colligative property of a solution is defined as the amount of pressure that must be applied to prevent water from diffusing into it. That would be Justin. Surface tension. Incorrect, osmotic pressure is what we needed there. Puritan governor of Massachusetts colony for nearly 30 years, this English separatist wrote of Plymouth Plantation. Time. That will be William Bradford. This document limiting the power of the English monarchy was signed in 1215 by King John I of England. Name it. That will be ransom. Uh, the Magna Carta. The Magna Carta is correct. In chemical calculations, non-zero digits are always or never significant. That would be, she get in time? Sophia. Never. I'm sorry, always is what we needed there. Risk and reward time. The topic of this is glands. You can 
risk up to 30 points in five point increments in on the question of glands or the topic of glands, or you can pass. Up to you, Alan East, your decision. Uh, we'll take it. Okay, how many points are you gonna risk? For 15 points. 15 points on glands. This gland is known as the master gland of the body because it produces hormones that travel throughout the body and because it stimulates other glands to release their hormones. That would be Justin. The pituitary gland. Pituitary gland is correct. Plus 15 for Alan East. And that is the end of the risk and reward round for you. Now it is time for you to go to isolation. Sophia, right this way. Let's bring back in Olin Tangi Berlin. Come on in. For our viewers, just let you know that there was a scoring correction at the end of the round. Olin Tangi Berlin, you were gonna start the risk and reward round with 10 points. Are you ready? for the risk and reward round. I see smiles and nod, heads nodding, so let's, let's get it started right now. In 1848, the Free Soil Party was founded in this New York City that sits on the shores of Lake Erie. Named this city known for its proximity to Niagara Falls, massive quantities of lake effect snow, and an NFL team known as the Bills. That would be Annabella. Buffalo. Buffalo is correct. True or false, Australia is surrounded by three oceans. That will be Ryan. False. It is unfortunately true. It is Pacific, Southern, and Indian, but I way to go for it. Here we go. The most common elements are hydrogen, carbon, and what? That would be Ryan. Helium. Helium. Incorrect oxygen is what we were looking for there. What part of one's body does the disease alopecia affect? That would be Annabella. Your head? No, we need specifically hair on that one. This animated film is based on The Snow Queen by Hans Christian Andersen and features the hit song, Let It Go. That would be Ryan. Frozen. Frozen is correct. Which colligative property of a solution is defined as the amount of pressure that must be applied to prevent water from diffusing into it? We need osmotic pressure there. Puritan governor of Massachusetts Colony for nearly 30 years, this English separatist wrote of Plymouth Plantation. Time. We were looking for William Bradford there. This document limiting the power of the English monarchy was signed in 1215 by King John I of England. Name it. That would be Ryan. The Magna Carta. Correct. In chemical calculations, non-zero digits are always or never significant. That in time, Ryan. Always. Correct. Risk and reward time. The topic is glands. You can risk up to 30 points in five point, point, excuse me, five point increments on this topic, or you can pass. The topic again is glands. What are you thinking? We'll do it. All right, how many are you gonna risk? Let's see, like 20. 20? 20 points, all right. 20 points on glands for Olin Tangi Berlin. This gland is known as the master gland of the body because it produces hormones that travel throughout the body and because it stimulates other glands to release their hormones. That would be Ryan. The pituitary gland. That is correct, plus 20 points to you. And Olin Tangi Berlin, that is the end of the risk and reward round for you. It is now time to clear our scores and let's bring back in Alan East.
Welcome back to Allen East. Let's take a look to see where our teams stand off against each other. Olin Tangi Berlin has 70 points. Allen East stands at 115 points. That risk and reward paid off for both of our teams. You don't want to stick around. We're just getting started here. Coming up next is our category round where things start to happen fast. We have questions worth up to 30 points apiece and deductions are going to start. Stay tuned. And welcome back to BGSU Brain Game. It is Allen East with 115 and Owen Tangi Berlin with 70 points. Looks like we have a little bit of a shakeup again on our lineups. Let's take a look at who has now joined the show. We have Owen Tangi Berlin. In slot number two, we have Ishan. And in slot number three, we have Akil. And for Allen East, in slot number three, we have Kaya. So welcome to you all. Uh, we are now moving into our category round. Now, this is where the power shifts a little bit to you, our teams. We have six categories to choose from. Inside each category are questions worth 10, 15, 20, 25, and 30 points. But dum, 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 that's right. Deductions start now. If you go for 15, you're risking 15 points. You may confer before buzzing in, and you can steal a question in this round. There is one double or nothing question hiding somewhere in there. It's worth double the points with no pressure. Could be a game changer. You never know. All right, uh, let's take a look at our score. Olin Tangi Berlin, since you are at 70 points and currently trailing, you have the honor of making the first selection. Ishan. Sports 20. Sports for 20 points. Identify the following people, places, or ideas associated with professional sports. This player once scored 100 points in an NBA game. That would be Ishan for Olin Tangi Berlin. Wilt Chamberlain. Wilt Chamberlain is correct. Olin Tangi Berlin still in control. Sports 15. Sports now for 15 points. Golfer who holds second place in the top major winners list with 15 major wins. Time. Uh, and no, not in time. We were looking for Tiger Woods there. Olin Tangi Berlin, still in control. Sports 25. Sports now for 25 points. What is the team nickname for the NBA team from Portland? That would be Ishan. The Trailblazers. Trailblazers is correct. Olin Tangi Berlin has now tied it and they are in control. Sports 30. Sports for 30 points. All-time regular season scoring leader in NHL history. That would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Akil. Wayne Gretzky. Wayne Gretzky is correct. Still in control. Well, let's finish off sports. Finishing off sports for 10 points. Considered to be the best quarterback to ever play in the NFL, this quarterback appeared in 10 Super Bowls. That would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Ishan. Tom Brady. That would be... Tom Patrick Brady. All right, Olin Tangi Berlin, that finishes off the sports category. It is now time for you to make a new selection. Begins with FRE 10. Begins with FRE for 10 points. Identify each of the following words that begins with the letter FRE. Goods carried as cargo by truck. That would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Akil. Freight. Freight is what we were looking for there, correct. Still in control is Olin Tangi Berlin. Begins with FRE 15. Now for 15, begins with FRE. Adjective that describes an event which occurs at close intervals. That will be Alan East, ransom. Frequent. Frequent is what we were looking for. Yes, and Alan East takes control. Greek and Latin prefixes for 15. Greek and Latin prefixes for 15 points. I will state a Greek or Latin prefix and a word that contains it. You provide the meaning of the prefix. Exo, as in exosphere. That would be Olin Tangi Berlin. Ishan. Outside. Outside, correct. Olin Tangi Berlin takes back control. Begins with FRE 20. Begins with FRE now for 20 points. Adjective that describes a markedly unusual occurrence. Time. The word that we were looking for there was freak. 
Uh, let's see, Olin Tangi Berlin still in control though. Begins with FRE 25. Begins with FRE now for 25 points. A state of violent agitation. That would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Annabella. Frenzied. Frenzy is indeed what we were looking for. Still in control, Olin Tangi Berlin. Let's finish out begins with FRE. Begins with FRE now for 30 points. One of several ridges set across the fingerboard of a stringed instrument. That will be Allen East Ransom. Fret. A fret is what we're looking for for the big 30. Allen East gets it and control. Greek and Latin prefixes for 20. Greek and Latin prefixes now for 20 points. Meso as in mesosphere. That would be Olentangy Berlin, Ishan. Middle. Middle is what we were looking for there, correct. Olentangy Berlin takes back control. Percents, 10. Percents for 10 points. What percent of 60 is 12? That would be Olentangy Berlin, Akil. 20. 20 is correct. Olentangy Berlin in control. Percents, 15. Percents now for 15 points. What is 5% of 40? That would be Olentangy Berlin, Ishan. Two. Two is correct. Olentangy Berlin in control. Let's do percents 20. Percents now for 20 points. What is 110% of 80? Olentangy Berlin, Akil. 88. 88 is correct. Olentangy Berlin in control, stepping on the gas. Percents 25. Percents for 25 points. What is 15% of 300? That will be Olentangy Berlin, Ishan. 45. 45 is correct. Olentangy Berlin still in control. Let's finish out percents. Finishing off percents for 30 points. 13% of 50 equals what? That would be Olentangy Berlin, Akil. 26. 16. Incorrect. Alan East, would you like to steal? That would be Ransom. 16. Incorrect. 6.5 is what we were looking for there. Uh, let's see, Olin Tangi Berlin still in control. Cooking 101 for 10. Cooking 101 for 10 points. End of round. Sorry about that. Let's take a look at our score. We have Olin Tangi Berlin at 265 points and Allen East at 130 points. But it's not over yet. You're going to want to stick around because our brainstorm round is coming up next. Questions are worth 20 points apiece. Stay tuned. Welcome back to BGSU Brain Game. Allen East, 130 points. Olin Tangi Berlin, 265 points. Looks like we have a returning player for Allen East. Cole, welcome back. Welcome back to you and everyone else, our returning players. Welcome to the final round. This is the brainstorm round, AKA all the marbles. It comes down to this. This is a timed round. Each question in this round is worth 20 points. Negative 20 points for an incorrect answer. You may confer before buzzing in, not after. If you do, that will be considered an incorrect answer. The big change in this round is there is no stealing. There is no stealing in this round. We will move immediately to the next question. At the end, we will announce a winner, meet in the middle, shake hands, and that'll wrap the show. All right, here we go. Olin Tangi Berlin. Alan East, you ready for the brainstorm round? Starts right now, here we go. Name the Middle Eastern country located directly south of the Black Sea. Its capital is Ankara. That would be Olentangy Berlin, Ishan. Turkey. Turkey is correct. Fundamental theory in physics that describes the behavior of nature at the scale of atoms and subatomic particles. That would be Alan East, Cole. Quantum physics. Quantum physics, will we accept that? We will. What was the first state to allow women to vote? That would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Ishan. Wyoming. Wyoming is correct. One of the many instruments in the cockpit of an airplane is an altimeter. What does an altimeter, that would be Olin Tangi Berlin, a keel? Like read the height. Uh, he says the height, will we accept that? We will accept that, or altitude. 
How many objects are in a baker's dozen? That would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Ishan. 12. Incorrect, 13. No stealing in this round, 13 in a baker's dozen. What is the square root of 484? Time, that would be 22. While most organisms use light from the visible light spectrum in photosynthesis, what longer wavelength can also be used by a few, that would be Olentangy, Berlin, Akil? Infrared. Infrared, they can be used by infrared. What American poet was nicknamed the New England mystic? That would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Ishan. Frost. Incorrect, Emily Dickinson is what we were looking for there. How many teaspoons are there in a tablespoon? That would be Alan East, Sophia. Three. Three is correct. With this disease more common in women than in men, the bones become fragile and porous. That would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Annabella. Osteoporosis. Osteoporosis, correct. What is the colored part of the eye called? That would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Annabella. The iris. The iris is correct. Who coined the term Iron Curtain to refer to, that would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Akil. Winston Churchill. Winston Churchill is correct. In describing a chemical reaction, what is the meaning of the term anhydrous? Time, that will be without water. What American general forced to leave the Philippines during World War II said, I, that would be Olin Tangi Berlin, Ishan. Douglas MacArthur. Douglas MacArthur is correct, saying I shall return. What is the tall end of round? Let's take a look at our score. Alan East with 170 points and our winner, Olin Tangi Berlin with 385 points. Let's give both these teams a big round of applause. The spirit of good sportsmanship, let's come out. We'll meet in the middle, shake hands, and we'll see you at the next BGSU Brand Game. Come on.